Welcome back. You know, Father's Day is right around the corner. It will be here before you know it. So we've got some great gift ideas. Adina is here to show us more on that, including something the kids can do. Yes. To make Father's Day one to remember. Exactly. Great to see you. Good to see you, too. Yeah, it's only a couple weeks away. It's going to be here, like you said, before we know it. Because kids are getting out of school, and summer is here, and that Today means Father's Day. Day and tomorrow, and that's right. That's right. But an easy way to do it, head over to Home Depot. They have some great gifts for Dad, whether it's outside for the patio, and some you know planting things or what dad doesn't like to grill there's some great great grilling things that they can get over at home depot they have everything from charcoal to uh, like 10 or 15 different grills tiki torches all kinds of fun stuff for that and so you can just really go crazy or a gift card i love those gift two. cards are always good <laughs> because then your husband or your dad can go and pick out whatever yes, he yes. wants and they have a huge selection of tools i mean mm -hmm. you know handyman tools are great for dad okay and i also love that they have projects for kids too they do they do and right before father's day they're going to have their kids workshop and so you can check your local home depot to find out when and, and what the item is or you can go online check out your ipad and go online and find out everything you need to know about that and, and usually it's free or there's a it's small completely free. fee completely so there it's free. free I know when my kids were younger we would take advantage of those and, yeah, and they get the cute little time. apron I think that's mm -hmm. awesome <laughs> Well, we're going to do some fun crafts. Yes. Little aprons. All right, yes. Okay, let's put our aprons on. We're going to put our aprons on and get crafty here. So they sell these hats over at Home Depot. Mm -hmm. These are pretty cool. You know, what, out working in the yard. I'm not going to put it on, but. <laughs> or just lounging in the just yard lounging by the in pool. The yard. So we're going to mm -hmm. make a cute little band. Every kid could do their own band for dad. So just go over let, to your craft store. Let me show you how cute this is. You know, you've heard of like a master gardener. Well, it's how about grill a master. grill master <laughs> dad? Isn't that cute? That's precious. If I could just see pictures of the kids and dad together. Love that. Okay, yes. this is very easy to this make, This is extremely right? easy, yes. Just head over to your local craft store and get what they call the fabric paints. These are just the scribbles. Okay. And here, I'm going to give you, fabric here, you do yellow. Because we're going to put this on the ribbon. On the ribbon itself. Okay. And this is just, get whatever thickness of ribbon you want. It doesn't matter. And you're just going to go ahead and color on there. Oops. Yikes. You got to maybe practice. You on can practice on some first. paper. That's right. I'm trying and to that way every dad. kid could do their own and then don't glue it to the hat just kind of glue the ribbon to the size of the hat and then that way you can switch them out you know maybe today he's grill master and tomorrow mm -hmm. he's number one dad and maybe he's sports fan USA <laughs> okay I really recommend that you practice first yes definitely you practice get extra <laughs> ribbon because you can see I haven't mastered the touch yet yes oh, and okay. while you're crafting okay um, Real quick tip on charcoal. After you're done grilling with the charcoal, take all that used charcoal and you can actually use it as a dehumidifier in your home. Or you can use it in the garden and it, regular charcoal that you haven't used yet and it's so porous it will actually hold in the moisture because you know with the droughts that we have around here it will actually help your garden. That is fascinating. Now I know that some of our charcoal got wet and so now my husband can't use it right. to grill. I'm wondering if you could still use you it. You could use the way it in the garden because it's going to hold that moisture in and help your garden out. Ah, so instead of throwing it exactly. away, keep it and Save reuse it. it. Reuse, okay, let's reuse. See. We've got some stickers here that we you can put use. some stickers on. Yes, and another really fun craft you could do is what they call a beer bucket or water bucket, whatever your dad likes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, there you go. There so you go. Look at that's so cute. Okay, I'm gonna right. move. I'm gonna move your little band here. Yes, let's call it the beverage. The bucket. beverage bucket. It could be water, Perfect. Sodas, Gatorade, <laughs> beer, wine, whatever, whatever you, you want to do. And a really easy way to craft this is again head over to your craft store mm -hmm. and get what they call the outdoor paints, and it has the same effect as your scribbles do. And you're just gonna go ahead, and it takes about 24 hours to dry, and just do whatever design you want. Look how easy it goes on. And you could even do some like little scribblies. I love this idea. Do whatever colors dad likes. And again, 24 hours, it's dry, fill it with some ice. Mm -hmm. Favorite beverages and exactly. you're ready to go. And here's a, a finished one right here if you're trying to envision how it would look. There you go. Isn't that cute? It's you put fun, number one it's dad easy. on there. Again, the kids could do it. You could do it for your dad or for your husband since you know, they're He's the dad of your kids. That's right. There you go. Great <laughs> ideas always when we're crafting with Adina. You can watch more of her great ideas by tuning into Time Warner Digital Cable Channel 989 at San Antonio On Demand. You can also check out the Express News Arts and Entertainment section. And, of course, try her website, craftingwithadina.com. Also, we got to say thanks to Home Depot. Adina found all the great items at the 281 store. Of course, there are many locations across town, one near you. You can get more information and ideas at homedepot.com. There's a number to call, 494-5580. That's for the 281 location. That's right. There you go. And we'll